welcome to all of you in teaching junction channel in this uh, tutorial we will learn how to make this gantt chart using microsoft excel in gantt chart uh, the project is divided into different phases or different tasks and uh, against each task time period is mentioned so let's start uh, this tutorial i have already entered the data uh, uh, to save time so go to insert tab column and chart bar and select stacked bar and do not select 100% bar uh, stacked bar chart so i select stacked bar chart so it insert an empty graph right click and uh, go to select data first click on uh, this add button and edit series appear series name uh, starting date and series values select this data oh, something happens wrong you have to select this data in series values select this data so uh, we have uh, completed this series click on ok then add another series name this duration and in series values select the data of duration so select this data click on ok and in horizontal axis labels click on edit axis label in axis label range select description of your project click on ok we have entered uh, selected all data and so i press ok so remember uh, whenever you want to make gantt chart you have uh, three type of data first the description of the project in which the division of the pro project is mentioned it may be tasks or phases of the project and starting date of each phase or each tasks and duration of each task if you have starting date and end date that is also fine so uh, i uh, we will further proceed it firstly select uh, these bars you see here that uh, only uh, portion of this bar is selected which is in blue one not, not this one so right click go to format data series and in fill and line go to fill and no fill so you can see here only these uh, this portion is left here so click on uh, these axis y axis right click uh, you don't need on already appeared format axis here so i check this categories in reverse order so phase one phase two and phase three phase four appear in uh, series now i want to uh, free this extra space so firstly i um, modify this axis go to home 12 bold sorry no and black color in here go to fill and line option click on line option and solid line black color one point five
so then click on axis options different axis options are available here go to tick marks and scroll down major type outside tick mark will be appeared on outside of this axis and you can see here tick marks are appeared here now i will format this axis you can see here that here the minimum and maximum values are appeared here and i will uh, i want to edit these values so this um, i want to remove this extra space so the starting date of my uh, project is 10 january so i will select the minimum value 5 january you can see here data uh, appear differently here so firstly i will uh, also write end date the phase 6 starting date is 19th may and it is a 30 day duration so i will select it in uh, 25 may enter I have selected this font here so it appears in this format but when I click here you can see the minimum and maximum uh, values are given in different numbers so I select these two dates go to this number and custom and click on number so uh, these dates change into number which is mentioned here so minimum date is 43835 and the maximum date we have selected it was 24 we have make a mistake i think we have a uh, right 25 may it should be 25 june so this day uh, we will convert this date into number double four double zero seven and we, we write it in maximum value double four double zero seven so click here and you can see here that the chart is modified so select uh, these bars go to fill and line it's i change its color to green border line solid line and black and uh, width one next i uh, click on effects 3d format in top barrel i will select hard edges so its shape is changed now width and height 100 each next i will format these axes go to fill and line solid line width 1.5 go to axis option now i want to change the format of this date so uh, firstly i will go to tick mark and i want that tick mark should appear outside of this axis 
major and minor both outside so go to number to change this date format in custom select date and you can see here different formats are appeared here and I want uh, this one so it appeared here now select this axis and change its font size as well as 12 you can also remove these lines no this one and use this handle to resize the graph now click on this <coughs> and if you want to add data label data table then check on this you can see here that uh, data table is appeared here which includes starting date and the duration as well but I, I don't want here I unchecked it and I want that data label if you can see data labels are appeared here I don't want these data labels so duration of the project is appeared here if you select this and you can also bold it and change its font size or style of font size so you also want if you want the axis title check this and chart for chart title check this one so you can also modify these axis and chart title go to formula bar and write description D. click enter change its color and 12 bold similarly you can also change this one starting date click enter black well and bold you can also modify the uh, chart title similarly write a scientific project press enter black color and font size 20 bold so finally we have uh, finished the formatting of our project now you can see here different faces and their duration it is also mentioned on these uh, bars as well so thanks for watching this tutorial stay tuned to this channel for future more interesting videos goodbye